Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to working on this very beautiful stitch. This is very very easy pattern. Okay, you can use this pattern for any spring or summer projects. You can use this for scarf or anything. You have to repeat only two rows for this pattern. And this is also nice color combo. If you want, you can use a single color with this pattern. That is also too good. Okay, so we can start working on this tutorial. So for this project, I am going to use uh, 3.E 3.5 mm hook. Okay, so make a slip knot like this. Now you have to start with the chain 17. The chain should be multiples of 4 plus 1. So I have completed with the 17 chains. Now I am going to add extra 3 chains. 1, 2, 3. Now you have to skip 5 chains. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In the 6th chain make a double crochet chain 1 double crochet. That is a first V stitch. So that 5 chains considers double crochet chain 1. So V stitch we have created. Now chain 1. Skip 3 chains. 1, 2, 3. In the 4th chain, make double crochet, chain 1, double crochet. Chain 1, skip 3 chains. 1, 2, 3. In the 4th chain, make double crochet, chain 1, double crochet. Then chain 1, skip 3 chains, 1, 2, 3, in the 4th chain make double crochet, chain 1, double crochet. And then you have to skip only 1 chain, make double crochet in the last chain. So this is the row 1 pattern. Now row 2, chain 1, turn your work. Make a single crochet in the same stitch. In the first V stitch, in first chain 1 space, you have to make a single crochet. Chain 3, 1, 2, 3. Again single crochet in the same chain 1 space. Then chain 3, 1, 2, 3. Again single crochet in the same chain 1 space like this. Now chain 1, have to do the same in next chain 1 space, single crochet, chain 3, single crochet, chain 3, single crochet, chain 1 and then the next V stitch here, make a single crochet, chain 3, single crochet, chain 3, single crochet, chain 1, like this. So you have to make the same in the next V stitch also. So I finished, see here, now make a single crochet in the last chain stitch to finish this round. Now I am going to change the color of the yarn and then start with the chain 3, 1, 2, 3, this is the row 3. Now you have to skip that first chain 3 space. Make a middle single crochet is the right, three single crochet we have made right. So in the middle single crochet here you have to make double crochet, chain one, double crochet. So make a V stitch in every middle single crochet of three single crochets. Okay, so like this now chain one, again skip the chain three space, single crochet and then again chain three space and then in the middle single crochet here make double crochet, chain one, double crochet. double crochet 
and then chain one then again next to middle single crochet make a double crochet chain one double crochet chain one and then again in the middle single crochet make sure you have to skip the chain three space two chain three space okay so double crochet chain one double crochet and then skip the chain three space in the last single crochet stitch you have to make a double crochet okay that you make sure so here to finish this round so that is the pattern okay so uh, next row 4 chain 1 turn your work make a single crochet in the same stitch now again in the chain 1 space make single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain 1 then in the next chain 1 space make single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain 1 then again chain 1 space make a single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain 3 single crochet chain one so like that you have to do in the next chain one space so this is the repeated pattern of only through two rows so and we have to use only double crochet and single crochet for this pattern so very very easy and simple stitch okay see here the design is too good v stitch single crochet v stitch row single crochet row like that you have to repeat now in the last chain stitch make a single crochet to finish this round this is the pattern of the stitch see here only you have to repeat row 3 and row 4 row 3 row 4 row 3 row 4 so like that you have to repeat next is row 3 and then row 4 row 3 row 4 so now you can see here just repeating v stitch single crochet v stitch single crochet stitch and starting and ending you just to make sure chain 3 and finish with double crochet and then chain 1 finish with single crochet single crochet so uh, very easy pattern you can definitely try this one if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment section i will definitely reply you so if you like this tutorial please subscribe to my channel and click notification bell icon i have given my facebook and insta link in the description you can follow me in the facebook and insta so you can definitely use this pattern if for a scarf thank you hi friends welcome to my channel today we are going to working on this beautiful stitch this is very easy stitch we have to repeat only two rows for the pattern this is the front side and this is the back side both look same okay so this pattern you can use for scarf or any crochet project so we have to start working on this tutorial i am going to use e 3.5 mm hook and medium four play on okay make a slip knot to start with the project now you have to make 17 chains actually the chain should be multiples of 4 plus 1 so multiples of 4 is 16 plus 1 17 so 17 chains we need to make like this now i have completed 17 chains i am going to add one more chain extra now you have to skip one chain in the next chain make a single crochet and then single crochet in every chain till the end of this row so you should get 17 single crochet at the end okay you just make a single crochet like this this is the row one pattern so i have completed this is the last single crochet now row two chain three one two three turn your work you have to skip one stitch in the next stitch make double crochet chain three double crochet double crochet 
டபுள் க்ரோஷே செயின் த்ரீ ஒன் டூ த்ரீ அண்ட் தென் டபுள் க்ரோஷே இந்த சேம் ஸ்டிச் அண்ட் தென் யூ ஹாவ் டு ஸ்கிப் த்ரீ ஸ்டிச்சஸ் ஒன் டூ த்ரீ இந்த நெக்ஸ்ட் ஸ்டிச் மேக் டபுள் க்ரோஷே செயின் த்ரீ டபுள் க்ரோஷே and then skip 3 stitches 1 2 3 in the next stitch make double crochet chain 3 double crochet so you have to repeat the pattern like this and then skip 3 stitches double crochet chain 3 double crochet then skip one stitch in the last stitch make a double crochet to finish this round this is the row 2 pattern okay we have completed two rows now third row chain 4 1 2 and 4 turn your work so now you have to make in the chain 3 space make up of stitch so yarn over insert a hook in the chain 3 space then pull the yarn this is the first time and then yarn over again this is the second time then yarn over third time yarn over fourth time and then fifth time and then sixth time so you have to make six times yarn over insert the hook and then pull the yarn and then make up of stitch like this okay now chain 4 1 2 3 4 in the next space is the right so here you have to make a single crochet in this space you have to make a single crochet like this now again chain 4 1 2 3 4 make up of stitch in the next chain 3 space here six times 1 ஸ்டிச்சஸ் completed see now you have to finish it off this round by making a triple crochet in the last stitch not making a chain four single crochet instead of that you have to make a triple crochet okay so the triple crochet you have to do yarn over two times and then make a triple crochet in the last stitch like this so pull through first two loops pull through next two loops and then pull through last two loops now i am going to change the color of the yarn like this 
okay now i'm going to change the brown color one chain three two three turn your work in the puff stitch right so here you have to make a double crochet chain three double crochet and then you have to skip the single crochet and the next puff stitch here you have to make double crochet chain three one two three double crochet and then skip the single crochet make a double crochet chain three double crochet in the next puff stitch in the next puff stitch you have to make double crochet chain three double crochet now you have to make a double crochet in the last stitch here to finish this round okay and the next is a puff stitch row for that chain 4 1 2 3 4 turn your work so in the first chain 3 space make a puff stitch so this row is exactly similar to row 3 6 times you need to make a puff stitch like this so 6th time now you have to make a puff pull through the loop and then pull through again the last two loops and then chain four one two three four single crochet in the next space here then again chain four one two three four the next chain three space make up of stitch so the pattern will be like that chain 4 puff stitch chain 4 then single crochet so like that you have to repeat and the next row is a v stitch row then puff stitch row the pattern should be like that pull through last two loops then make a chain 4 1 2 3 4 single crochet in the next space okay that's it so you have to repeat row 3 and row 4 for the desired length. Okay, just to repeat the two rows. So V stitch row, puff stitch row, V stitch row, puff stitch row. Like that you have to repeat. But start with the single crochet row. But at starting and beginning you must take care about that. Because we have to start with chain 3 and finish with triple crochet. That is also you need to keep in mind. Okay, and then V stitch chain 3 you have to finish with double crochet so that is the main thing we need to consider so i hope you really enjoyed this tutorial so i have um, this is the color combo i have used very unique and different color combo okay so if you like this tutorial please subscribe to my channel and click notification bell icon i have given my facebook and insta link in the description you can follow me in facebook and insta so this is the pattern you can definitely use this pattern for any crochet project okay so if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment section you just repeat only two rows for hold the pattern okay and you can try to use different color combination or you can use single color also it's it will be good single color or double color but i have used multicolor multicolor and with bright combinations okay so thank you hi friends welcome to my channel today we are going to working on this beautiful stitch this stitch you can use for any summer or spring top or baby dress or sweater any project you can use this stitch this is very easy we have to repeat only three rows for whole pattern and we need to use only double crochet and puff stitch for the pattern okay so this is a beginner pattern and you can use single color or multicolor for this stitch it looks too good okay we can start working on this tutorial 
So for this project, I'm using 4 ply yarn and 3.5 mm hook. So first you have to make a slip knot to start the project. Like this. And then make a chain 13. Actually the beginning chain should be multiples of 2 plus 1. So multiples of 2 is 12 plus 1 13. So you have to make 13 chains like this. Just continue making 30 chains. So I have completed. Now I am going to add 3 more chains extra. 1, 2, 3. Now you have to skip 5 chains. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In the 6th chain you have to make a double crochet. So this 5 chain considers double crochet chain 1. Okay. So like this and then chain 1. Skip one chain. In the next chain make a double crochet. Chain one. Skip one chain. And in the next chain make a double crochet. Chain one. Skip one chain. Next chain make a double crochet. And then chain 1, skip 1 chain, next chain make a double crochet. Chain 1, then skip 1 chain. In the last chain make a double crochet to finish this round. So this is the row 1 pattern. You can see this is a very simple pattern, right? So row 1 we have completed. Now we have to start with row 2. Chain 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Turn your work. Skip the chain 1 space. You have to make a double crochet in the next stitch. And then chain 1. Skip the chain 1 space. Make a double crochet in the next stitch. Then chain 1. Skip the chain 1 space, make a double crochet in the next stitch, chain 1, skip the chain 1 space, make a double crochet in the next stitch, then again chain 1, skip chain 1 space, make a double crochet in the next stitch, now chain 1, now skip 1 chain here, in the next chain you have to make a double crochet. So this is the row 2 pattern. Two rows we have completed. See here. Like this. Now third row. Chain 3. Turn your work. Now in the next chain one space here right. So you have to make a puff stitch. So yarn over. Insert the hook in the space. First time. And then yarn over. This is the second time. And then yarn over. Insert the hook third time and then yarn over insert the hook fourth time. So four times you need to insert the hook and then pull through all the yarns then make a chain and then again make a chain one. So the same way you have to make a puff stitch in the next chain one space. So the every chain one space you have to make a puff stitch four times you need to make okay. this and pull through all the loops then make a chain chain 1 then again make a puff stitch in the next chain 1 space pull through all the loops make a chain and then chain one so just continue like this till the end
last chain 1 space make a puff stitch pull through all the loops make a chain but here you no need to make chain 1 directly you have to work on double crochet in the last stitch to finish this round this is the third row so now I am going to change the color of the yarn I always changing the yarn like this way so you just hold the two yarns like this then make a double crochet so you can secure two yarns and then you can take the another color make a chain four one two three four okay you can also use this method now skip the puff stitch here in the chain one space you have to make a double crochet now chain one and then skip puff stitch make a double crochet in the chain one space then chain one skip puff stitch make a double crochet in the chain one space and then chain one double crochet in the chain one space now chain one skip puff stitch double crochet in the chain one space and then chain one double crochet in the last stitch to finish this round row 4 okay and then row 5 is exactly similar to row 2 so chain 4 turn your work skip the chain 1 space make a double crochet in the double crochet stitch and then chain 1 double crochet in the double crochet stitch so you have to work on double crochet in every double crochet stitch by making chain 1 in the middle so chain 1 double crochet chain 1 double crochet by skipping chain 1 space ok so this is exactly similar to row 2 and then now make a double crochet in the third chain now chain 3 1 2 3 turn your work this row is similar to row 3 ok so next chain 1 space here make a puff stitch four times and then pull through all the loops make a chain and then chain one so again you have to make a puff stitch in the next chain so like that you have to repeat the pattern so this is a very easy simple and pretty stitch okay so you have to repeat row two row three row 4 see here repeat 3 3 rows and I have changed a color 3 3 colors ok if you like this tutorial please subscribe to my channel click notification bell icon I have given my facebook and insta link in the description you can follow me in facebook and insta if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comments hi friends Thank you. welcome to my channel today we are going to working on this very beautiful stitch this is very very easy stitch you can use this stitch for any spring or summer projects only repeating four rows for this project okay and you can use multicolor or single color you can use this stitch for scarf also so blanket any crochet project you can use this stitch so we can start working on this tutorial i am using e 3.5 mm hook first you have to make a chain 19 the chain should be multiples of 6 plus 1 multiples of 6 is 18 plus 1 19 so you have to make 19 chains like this so just continue making 19 chains so I have completed with 19 chains now you have to make extra 3 chains 1 2 3 so you have to skip the 3 chains in the 4th chain make a double crochet chain 1 skip 2 chains in the next chain make a double crochet chain 1 skip 2 chains in the next chain make 3 double crochet so 1 2 3 
chain 1 and then skip 2 stitches make a double crochet so double crochet 3 double crochet double crochet 3 double crochet should be alternative and then by skipping 2 2 stitches in the middle so this is the pattern of row 1 and then skip 2 stitches next stitch make a double crochet like this ok so now in 1 skip 2 stitches in the last stitch make a 2 double crochet so you have to start it with 2 double crochet and end it with 2 double crochet so this is the row 1 pattern ok it is it should be like this 3 double crochet double crochet 3 double crochet double crochet now we have to start the throw 2 chain 3 turn your work now make a double crochet in the same stitch and then double crochet in the next stitch chain 1 so skip next double crochet then in the next stitch make a one double crochet then in the second double crochet stitch make three front post double crochet so one two three and then like this double crochet in the next stitch Okay, chain 1 then skip next double crochet then in the next stitch make a double crochet and then in the middle double crochet stitch make 3 double front post double crochet 1 2 3 and then double crochet in the next stitch chain 1 then again do the make a skip one double crochet and then make double crochet in the next stitch and in the last stitch make two double crochet so you have to start with three double crochet end with three double crochet that is the pattern of row 2 okay the design will be like this now I am going to change the color of the yarn then make a chain 4 1 2 3 4 turn your work now you have to make a skip 2 stitches and in the next space you have to make 3 double crochet so 1 2 3 and then chain 1 skip next to two stitches in the third stitch here make a double crochet chain one and then skip two stitches the next space make three double crochet two three chain one and then skip two stitches the next stitch make a double crochet chain 1 and then skip 2 stitches in the next space make 3 double crochet 1 2 and 3 then chain 1 so skip 2 stitches in the last stitch make a double crochet to finish this round so this is the row 3 pattern ok So now row 4, chain 3, turn your work. Now you have to make double crochet in the next stitch and then 3 front post double crochet in the next double crochet stitch. So 1, 2, 3 
and then double crochet in the next stitch chain one okay now skip the double crochet stitch in the next double crochet stitch make one double crochet and then the next make three front post double crochet so one two three and then double crochet in the next stitch chain one then again you have to skip a double crochet stitch the next stitch make a double crochet and then three front post double crochet in the next one two three and then double crochet in the next stitch now chain one make a double crochet in the next okay now you have to start with row five for row four rows completed now fifth row changing the color of the yarn now make a chain three turn your work and then in the same stitch make a double crochet chain one then skip two stitches in the next stitch make a double crochet chain one and then in the next stitch space make three double crochet so one two three and chain one then again skip two stitches in the next one make double crochet chain one then in the next space make three double crochet one two three chain one then again skip two stitches in the next stitch make a double crochet then skip two stitches chain one make two double crochet in the last stitch okay and chain three turn your work this row is exactly similar to row two okay you have to follow the same pattern in the row two so now in the same stitch make a double crochet and then in next stitch make one double crochet Ch chain one now skip double crochet stitch and then same like in the row two we follow right the same pattern you have to follow here so skip one double crochet stitch in the next one make one double crochet and then in the next stitch make three front post double crochet so one two and three in the next stitch make one double crochet chain one then skip one double crochet stitch in the next one make double crochet and then three front post double crochet in the next one two three and then double crochet in the next stitch chain one now you have to make a double crochet skip one double crochet stitch and double crochet in the next one and then two double crochet in the last stitch To finish this round okay that's it so you have to repeat row 3 row 4 row 5 row 6 okay next two will be row 3 and row 4 okay and then row 5 and row 6 row 3 row 4 row 5 row 6 like that you have to repeat only four rows for the whole pattern okay so you just continue with the same, same pattern this is a very easy one now you can see here just repeating four 
rows for the pattern. So if you really like this tutorial, please subscribe to my channel and click notification bell icon. I have given my Facebook and Insta link in the description. You can follow me in Facebook and Insta. If you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment section. I will definitely respond to you. You can definitely try this one. It looks too good. So thank you very much.